I'm really familiar with them. You know, obviously just doing the recruiting process, you know, St. John Bosco is one of those schools where, you know, if you don't stop through, you don't know what you're doing, but uh, you know, so getting, getting a chance to uh, watch him through the recruiting process. And um, obviously the, the cool thing about, you know, this recruiting process is you get a chance to meet these kids even, even if you, you don't end up recruiting them or coaching them uh, early on, but so that part of it, I know a lot about him um, personally. And I think the one thing that I will say when it comes to him watching him as he's developed here at Boise State is he's a special player. You know, Lee Marks did a heck of a job of getting him here to Boise State. Um, you know, so shout out to Lee there. And then the next part of that is the thing about George, he can run you over. He's athletic out the backfield. Um, he, he's, he's great in transition is one thing that I'm always coaching in fundamentals when it comes to that make you miss ability, being able to run through tackles, he's able to stutter, stop guys. Now, the one thing I hope I can, you know, help continue to build on is, you know, keeping him healthy, um, throughout the course of a full season. Cause I think that's important. Um, but I think that's, uh, that's one of those things where you can kind of help develop him as a runner and, um, how he's taking care of himself in the off season between me and the, uh, uh, strength coaches and the training staff, because he's a guy, you know, in, in the likes of, you know, Doug Martin and Jay Ajay, if you keep help, keep him healthy, it can change the course of a season. Um, you know, you know, got games when he's not in, you notice when George Helani's not in the football game. And, you know, having a guy like that in the room, um, it feels like a gift. It's right after Christmas. So Christmas is coming early for 2022. So I don't have to come in and, you know, try to figure out, okay, who's going to be the guy here? But, you know, obviously I think the other part of that is, you know, thinking about this running back room. And I was um, just talking with some people today, you know, it's really important that uh, if George Lonnie's Batman, we're able to develop a Robin. Um, we have to develop a quality Robin. And what I mean by that, you know, he is going to take his toll, his, his toll of hits and protection and run the ball and catching the ball out the backfield. So when he needs a breather, we need to have a guy that's set and ready to go. Um, so when he comes off the field, we don't miss a beat. Um, obviously him being the lead dog, it's important, but you want to make sure you can keep him healthy throughout the course of not only just the seasons, but through games as well. You know, keep him fresh through games. We keep him fresh. We're going to have a, a, a special room.